Hello guys, this is Joyce and I am here and it's like really late at night, 12, almost 1 o'clock in the morning. But I am here because it is time for another Saturday morning challenge of friends and I got my little um, Tim Holtz mat for gluing and stuff on the desk and some little bits and pieces that I was using. Anyway, this week's um, challenge was to use any paper collection that you wanted. And at first we were going to do my mind's eye and most of my mind's eye pads, I don't have any embellishments and Shantae said the same thing. So we decided we would use any collection that we wanted and we are going to make memory dex cards. So I have a few shapes and stuff. This is one. Uh, so we were going to do memory dex cards and we have to do six, six. And funny thing is about my mind's eye is that when I was going through stuff, I remembered that I had this collection, Gal Meets Glam. And I only had like a couple of the six by six pads. I never could find the 12 by 12 kit but I had the pad and then I had some embellishments and I had a couple of these that I got it Tuesday morning and then I had the stamp set and this was the original stamp set that I got last year and then when I was in the store recently and I was going to do I'm going to do a haul and show this I found this stamp set. So of course I bought it because I'm like, oh, I got that paper, let me get this. And it has some of the same elements. The young lady just has a different dress. I mean, and the words are sort of different, you know? So it was great to have these because then I could mix and match. Well, this one has two dies also. The diamond and a shoe which I did use both of those and I had stamped the girls but then I decided eh, it wasn't it wasn't working for me so I used those things um, and like I said I've used sheets from this pad this has quite a bit of paper left but this one hasn't been open I just I'm not even sure why I pulled it out but I also pulled out my Heidi Swap um, memory dex dies. I have both of them. And then I also have the ones from AliExpress, which, where are they? I have these two. So I use those. And then I use the words from this stamp set. I've had this stamp set forever. It is from Hero Arts and it was just shoes. Uh, I mean it is really old. I bought this I think I brought this um, probably right after I moved down here and I've been living here for 18 years. So I've had this stamp set. Nope, I'm going to take that back. It hasn't been that long. I bought this set after I started making cards just cause I have a thing for shoes so it seems like it's been that long but it really hasn't so we're gonna move that and then I used I pulled out quite a few things to use I used a couple pieces of this bling which is just some Michaels bling that I have had forever but I've used almost half of it I used um this Lawn Fawn die. I used um, this die, this one right here. I stamped the words from here, and you'll see that later. I used one of the girls from Paper Studios. I used what else did I use? I used some bling that, that I don't see anymore. And I actually stamped some of the stamps 
And after I stamped this shoe, which is cute, I realized I could cut it out with the die and just, you know, don't have to worry about that. And then the diamond, I just cut it out in gold paper. Oh, guys, I am so sorry. And something else that I did use, and, oh, I used some of my flowers from here. I used some of the pink ones, some of the smaller ones, like this size. So... It's good to have those right on the desk. So all of these things I used and will have to be put back up soon. Okay, guys. So, yeah. Now I'm going to come back and I use some of this bling here. I pulled out a lot of stuff to use. But I'm going to be right back so that I can show you my, um, my projects. Alright guys, I am here to show you my projects and I'm excited about them because I love making memory decks cards and I am still working on the cards for my swap that I want to do. It's slow process, but okay, let's move these out the way so I can show you. I did show you some of the stamps that I had stamped out. Okay guys, so I told you I was using the Girl Meets Glam collection and I showed you all my products that I use. So let's see a couple things that else that I did use. I used one die from here and I used, um, what else did I use? I think that's going to be about it. Um, so, let's start with this one. It is very simple. And this dress is a dress from a different collection. It is from the um, Vintage Vintage Girl. Is that it? Uh, vintage yeah, Vintage Girl. This um, is part of that set, but that dress was just, I cut it off of that sheet there, uh, or one like it, and it was just because I needed a dress, and I didn't feel like coloring anything, so, and then that is just, here is just that diamond die that I cut, and then this uh, one-of-a-kind sentiment came out of that Vintage Girl uh, collections so kind of mixing a match and this is one of the papers from the gal meets glam uh, and on the back I just use red cardstock and that's the bling that I showed you so that's one we had to make six and no more than two exactly alike so now this is the die from um, AliExpress and I probably shouldn't say that but that's where it's from and then that's the shoe die from the gal meets glam and this is the set from the uh, graphic 45 no the is it hero arts the kick up your heels oh yes yeah, the hero arts sorry yeah, that's the sentiment from this stamp set, which you can tell I have stamped them a lot because they turn kind of yellowish, but they stamp great. I've used them over the years quite a bit. So anyway, that is that one. And I haven't done anything to the back. You can see where I kind of got that one off, but I'm just going to ink it and keep going. So that is number two. And then number three, I used the paper from the Gal Meets Glam. This stamp is from the shoe stamp set I just showed you. That little bling there is from the, you know, you saw all that. And these are some of my uh, heartfelt creations flowers and the leafy leaves that I cut a piece off and put, layered on top of, underneath there. So, and this one is a... Uh, this um, memory decks card is a Heidi swap 
and it's come from the set with the tabs. So that's three. Oh, and don't forget Hobby Lobby. I'm down to only a few of the girls, but I really would love to finish them off. And then number four, this is also, <laughs> see I use those shoes again. I like that dye, okay? And then um, I popped one shoe up and then I did one, but I also layered a piece of, because I used this uh, Michaels, um, foil paper. I don't see the piece that I cut off. Oh, it's on the dye machine. But I used a piece of the Michaels and you know it's kind of thin. I should have used the one with the craft paper on the back, but I didn't think about it. But so I put a piece, I used a piece of the red paper and I just cut the shoe twice for each shoe. And I layered the gold on top of the red just to give it more body. And then I just adhere at the bottom one flat and then I pop the second one up and then these pieces are from the Gal Meets Glam um, em embellishments that I had. Well, I guess they're embellishments but the words and they're kind of like acrylic so this one just and the paper is also from that collection and it just says Glam Slay and then I use that diamond I really love these pieces and I wish, wish I had bought more than the two sets. So then that's four. And then more paper from this collection and that bling. And the eyelashes is just too cute. And it just says, Hello Bestie. And that is also from that um, acrylic set. They already were adhesived and I love that. Um, like I said, I wish I had bought, because at the time I think when I got them, they had several and I should have got more than that because it's a collection that you will always use. You could mix that with the Fashionista collection. And so that is five. And then six is very simple one. And I use more of that eyelash, but this is from the uh, Graphic 45 stamp set that I showed you. Um, and there's a collection for Graphic 45 that goes with this. I just love that image. And I love that saying by Coco Chanel. And it just says that a girl should be two things, classy and fabulous. So I really love that and that's another one of those things that I use quite a bit. So I just um, stamped it on a piece of paper use, and then cut it out using that die there. And I also layered it with a piece of red cardstock underneath and I popped it up with some foam tape. And then I just adhered some more of those eyelashes because, hey. I thought that would be a cute, cute little accent and then just some more of that bling. So guys, those are my six memory deck cards. And I love how they turned out. And see, I cut that little house. I was going to use that and it, I just couldn't make it work with the uh, collection. But I'm going to do a travel set next. Um, so guys, those are my memory dex cards for this Saturday morning challenge of friends. Don't forget to go by and check out Shantae and leave me a comment. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. And I'm going to take pictures and look, have those on my um, Instagram. And you can go over and see them up close and personal there. So guys, thanks so much, and I've got to try to get this loading because we need to have it up by 8, I think. So guys, thanks so much for watching, and like I said, don't forget to come by and check us out. Bye.